Hello everybody from St. Clairsville, Ohio. I'm sorry that it's taken this long to do a Dollar Tree Christmas video. I've had so many other videos that we've been doing and we've gone everywhere but Dollar Tree. So I am happy to finally do one for you. I expect the store to be picked through. Uh, the, but we're going to go do a video anyway because I love Dollar Tree and I love doing these videos for you guys. But anyway, we'll take a look in there, see what they have left. I'm sure it's probably ransacked in there, but I'm going to do the video anyway and I just hope you enjoy. This store that I'm at is a newer location. They used to be on the other side of this whole shopping center over by Kroger. And uh, there's a, a restaurant over there too, a Mexican restaurant that Kayla and I ate at the last time we were in town and it was closed and it was small it wasn't worthy of doing a video and this is the location that it moved to so let's go let's get in there and take a look at what they have yep that's the new dollar tree finally doing one i know my boss will be happy he was telling me his grandchildren are telling me uh do a couple videos here at dollar tree so here you go this is for you dan and the littles <laughs> actually they have more than i thought they would have wow Look at all the flowers they got. Festive flowers. What do they have here? Gift boxes, tissue. Look at these tiny little gift bags. Cool little signs. They have a lot more than I thought they would have. A lot of wrapping paper. Here's Elf. Peanuts. Frosty. Very cool. Look at this. Look at all the candy canes and candy. Things are still a dollar here as far as I know. They're not a dollar twenty-five yet. That's cool. Look at all the candy. Great for stocking stuffers. This is the kind of store you want to go to for stocking stuffers. You get all kinds of goodies in here. I do this all the time. So anyway, here's oh look at these. Sounds gross. <laughs> yeah, they have Mike and Ike, Sour Patch. These are good too. I think you only get one or two in there. Look at the little bag of kisses. They're pink for Valentine's Day. <laughs> All right. Then over here we have mugs. We have a lot of holiday mugs. Lots of holiday mugs. And, oh, and dishware. Look at the, these dishes aren't bad. Porcelain, too, for a dollar a piece. Not bad. Nice little festive glasses as well. You know how hard it was to find tinsel for our Christmas tree at home? I wanted to change it up and go with a white one. Couldn't find it anywhere. Probably went to 30 stores around Pittsburgh. Nothing. I come out here, tons of it. Yeah, they have all different colors. They have red, they have white and red. I ended up finding a good one that was white. We had this on our tree, this blue one with the snowman, but it was hard to see on the tree. So I wanted something that popped. So I got a white one that I found. I think I found a family dollar in Sharpsburg. Anyway, they have a lot of paper plates, the festive paper plates. Great for parties, great for your Christmas parties. If you have a Christmas Eve get together like my aunt and uncle always have, it's festive and easy to clean up. Look at the little tinsel snowman. Hi buddy, he's missing an eye. Boy, this guy had been through the war and back. There we go, <laughs> poor fella. Wow, this aisle is completely full. I thought this place would be empty. There's so much more stuff here than I expected. This is fantastic. Look at the season's greeting sign with a camper on it. Even a tinsel camper. Fun holiday glasses. Look at the little stuffed animals. They have little friends here. I don't see its eyes. They're in there. You're blind. There you go. Hey, what's up, bud? <laughs> go hang out with your friends. That's cool. And they have little Santas. Oh, look, they got little elves as well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they have Santa down here. They have snowmen as well. Very cool. They have all kinds of treat bags, uh, silly glasses, tic tac toe, gift tags, door covers, and here's window decorations and window clings. These are nice. I like these ones. Oh, look at this one with the raccoon, and that looks like a uh, like a hedgehog on there, and the owl. That's very cool. And they have little tiny tree skirts, headbands, and they have some stockings as well. Little Santa hats. 
Down here we have more headbands. They're just kind of scattered around little trees. They have festive candy dishes here. I like the tree one. Whack-a-pack balloons. They're like little bomb bags. <laughs> I, a lot of fun pranks with those in school. Jeez. Could have that been any louder. Anyway, they have more gift tags. Look at these gift tags. Look at those. And you get a hundred of them? Oh, are those cute? I'm buying those. I need gift tags anyway. Those are so cute. I'm buying those. My goodness, this is the place you want to go to. Look at all the wrapping paper in here. Not only wrapping paper, look at all the gift bags they have in here. And if you thought this aisle had a lot of gift bags in it, which by the way, let me interrupt myself, I love that one and that one and this one. Those are my favorites. And actually, I need a big bag like this for a gift for my aunt and uncle. But I need it to be wider on the bottom than these ones are. Yeah, they have more gift bags back here. Look at that. They, they don't have a shortage here. Look at that one. I like that. Oh, the Merry Christmas Farm one. A Christmas Farm bag. I like that. And look, they got even more on this back wall. Oh my gosh. This is the headquarters for gift bags. Holy smokes, guys. There's more behind me, too. Look at that. I have... This is where you want to go. This is where they have what you need for your gift giving. I just love some of these bags. When I'm not filming, I'm going to look through some of them and see if they have a wide enough bag that I can fit a bird feeder that I bought for my aunt and uncle in a Texas handmade, hand-painted bird feeder. Here's a picture of it to, so you can see it. How cool is that? Well, it's a video clip anyway, but I hope you enjoy that. The lady handcrafted that, and I bought it. It was like $25, and... I thought my aunt and uncle, they love that kind of stuff, so I thought that would be perfect for them. Next, nice little Texas-themed thing, and it supported a, a lady that painted it. I like these gift boxes here, the little mailboxes. They have a lot of them. Look at the holiday tins, the gingerbread. <laughs> all right, now we have lots of candy. Look at all the candy. This is where your stocking stuffers are. I mean, you don't even have to just get Christmas-themed ones. You could get whatever you like. This store is notorious for having good selection of candy to begin with. But if you want holiday themed candy, here you go. Wow, a bag of Kit Kats for a dollar. I think I'll get that for myself. Don't worry, guys. I'm not just shopping for myself. I'm getting Kayla some stocking stuffers while I'm here. I'm going to get her some Starburst. She loves Starburst and some other little knickknacks and those chocolate covered cherries. So we're good to go. She loves Hershey's Kisses too, so I'll get her a bag of those. Yeah, maybe I'll get her one of the pink bags. These gray ones are boring. Let's go over here. Where I saw the... Here they were. Grab a pink bag. They're all the same. And now I've got to the point where I need a hand basket. Here we go. And out of the plethora of hand baskets I have with the newer logo, I picked one with the older logo. I got lucky on that one. They have these cute little tinsel wreaths that you can hang anywhere you like. They're not too bad for a dollar. Nice little signs here, wall art. They have plenty of wall art on here. Not that I need any more. I don't need any more. But I do like that one with the RV on it. The camper, anyway. And the one that says peace on it. Back here we have a lot more wrapping paper. And we have some gift boxes here, too. Not bad for a buck, or a buck twenty-five. And like I was showing you before, lots of gift bags. And then on this side, I had to wait because there was a... Uh, another customer shopping. They have a lot of tissue paper in here too. That's also something I need. And lots of gift boxes. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna grab a thing of tissue paper because I do need it. Even though I wish they had something a little more fun than the, oh wait, they do. Put that one back. Look at that. Whoop. That's better. They have a lot of bows up in these boxes too, but I don't really need those. I have a bunch at home, but the paper is good. Oh wait, I see more. I like this one too. It says Christmas on it. You get the regular red and green. Merry Christmas. I like the one I got though. I like that one better. So I'll buy that one. They have some little stocking stuffer gifts here. Last minute gifts. More gift bags, more Hershey's Kisses. Look at the little penguin bucket. <laughs> what are these? Oh my god, chair covers. You can put a big Santa hat on your chairs. 
Jeez, that's kind of corny. It's cool, and I love Christmas, but that's kind of corny. They have lots of colorful and festive holiday socks. I think the pink ones would be perfect on me. What do you think? <laughs> they have light up necklaces I, like i said remember i've pointed these out at other stores where they're like three four bucks and here they are a dollar or a dollar 25 but yep they have those oh look at these little signs that would be cute for like a bathroom good tidings of comfort and joy let me move that tag see not too bad and speaking of wall art they have more over here with more gift bags it's like this place got everything and the other stores didn't get jack crap <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of tinsel decorations, but these aren't too bad. I do like these ones better though, these these decorations here. Let me see this blue one. Let it snow. You see that in there? <laughs> they have Christmas cards. This just this isn't the only section of Christmas cards. They have more around the side here. I'll show you that in just a moment. While we wait for the customer to finish shopping over the gift, over the uh, cards, I'll show you these little things. Look at these little things. They clip on whatever you like. You can clip them onto your tree. I like that with a cardinal on it. And since I'm a percussionist, I like this one with the drum on it. And the pine cone and the present. What's this one with a snowball? Oh, like a cotton plant and berries. That's cute. I like how they have several different kinds. Oh, here's one with a bell on it too. Take a look at that one. Oh, glitter galore. Not bad, though. Boy, they sure love gift boxes here. But they don't just have gift boxes. I saw more tins over here, more holiday tins. Uh, where did I see? Oh, here they are, right here. Look at that. All kinds of Christmas tins. You can put cookies or snacks or whatever you like in there. They have cotton candy. I know Kayla loves cotton candy. I'll get her that for a stocking, too. Vanilla snow? What's this one? Candy cane, cotton candy. Get her that one. She loves cotton candy. Look at this, Warhead candy canes. Oh my gosh. Cut out decoration on back? <laughs> That's cool, you can make a little ornament hanging on your tree. They also have holiday cookies, very nice. And here are those Starbursts that she loves. Good stocking stuffer. She loves those. And I start looking at candy for myself. Don't do it, Wally. Don't do it. But, but, I can't. Yeah, don't do it. You can't. You, you got this. I'm such a nerd. Oh, chocolate covered cherries. Get her a box of these, too. Put in her stocking stuffer. Here they have ornaments and tree toppers. I like the owl. Look at the owls. How cute that is. I like that. That's one his head is coming apart there. Just needs glued back on. But these owls are so cool. I like the snowy owls. They have another one hiding back here. Look at that. He's a chunky little thing like me. <laughs> I do like that owl though. I think I have to buy him. All right, now that that lady left, now I can show you the greeting cards that they have for Christmas. They have a pretty good selection for just about everybody in the family. They even have some on the other side. Check out the kitty here, by the way. They have some on the other side of the aisle that are two for a dollar. Pretty good deal. Here they are here, as a matter of fact. Two for a dollar. And they're not bad, as opposed to cards that are five, six, even seven dollars these days elsewhere. They have Mardi Gras masks already. I, I assume they were trying to shoot for New Year's with this idea, with the the little horns and the squeaker things, but the masks, I mean, that's cool and all, but it's not even winter yet. <laughs> but I like their thinking, I'll get the summer stuff out. All right, well, that's gonna wrap up my look here at the Dollar Tree out here in St. Clairsville, Ohio. Dan, I hope you enjoyed that. Hey, look at this. We got the bee friend there, and then we have a little twin here. <laughs> Love when I see other G5s, that's awesome. Anyway, I'm taking off. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you give the video a like. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe to the channel for more content. And with that said, everybody, I'll talk to you later. And Dan, I hope you liked us. I hope your grandchildren did too. See you later, everybody. Take care, stay awesome. And on Kayla's behalf, have a Dollar Tree-licious day.